Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video I'll be showing you how to fix Madden 24 giving you a EA anti-cheat error message. So if you're trying to play the game and it's saying that the EA anti-cheat service is unavailable, giving you a unrecoverable error or some sort of message related to the EA anti-cheat then this is how you can resolve those errors. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is download a program that I created called Easy Game Utility. So once you've downloaded it, open up the program and you will end up with a window that looks like this. Go ahead and click on the Fix tab. Now this is going to be the fastest way, as long as it works, to fix the error that you're currently receiving. So click on the Fix tab, then scroll down. You will then see Custom Game Fixing. Click on Browse. Locate the games.exe so you can see it's there, Madden24, click on open and then click on the drop down and select the EA app. Now once you've selected this, go ahead and click on attempt to fix and Easy Game Utility will now attempt to fix the issue that you're currently having with the game and hopefully it will fix the EA anti-cheat error message that you have in. You will get free attempts with the free version of Easy Game Utility. If you want unlimited attempts, then you will need to purchase the pro version. So you can see there, it's now launching the game. It does say run this as an admin. I didn't actually run it as an admin, but if I had done that, it would have ran a couple more steps in trying to resolve the error. So you can see there, the game's worked fine and it's now launching on my computer. I'm just gonna close that down quickly. So if that didn't resolve the EA anti-cheat error that you're currently having, then the next thing that you want to do is just close all this down and then open up File Explorer. Once you have File Explorer open, go to the location where you installed the game. So I've installed mine on my cheat drive and in the games folder, then EA app and then Madden NFL 24. The next thing that you're going to want to do is open up the installer folder and you then need to go into the EA anti-cheat folder and double click on this file here. Right click on it actually and go run as administrator. The next thing you want to do is click on the drop down and select the game, Madden 24, and you're then going to want to go uninstall. Once that's uninstalled, go ahead and click on install again. Once it's finished installing, just give it a second, you can see it's now installed, click on update. And this is just going to ensure that it's up to date and everything's all working as it should be. So you can see I've now got update success. Close this down, try launching Madden 24 again and see if that resolved the issue. If that didn't fix the problem, then the next thing that you're going to want to do if you're using Windows Firewall, which you probably, well, you might be, open up the start menu and then type in firewall. If you're using a third party security program, then you're going to have to figure out how to add the EA anti-cheat to the exception list. So we need to select Windows Defender Firewall. Um, I selected the wrong thing there. Let's try that again. So go firewall and it's not actually there. Click on settings, there we go. Windows Defender Firewall. We then want to click on allow an app or feature. You then need to click on change settings and you then need to just click anywhere on the list and press E on your keyboard. You now need to ensure that you've got the EA app anti-cheat in the list. So you can see I'm actually currently missing it. So what I'm gonna have to do now is locate it. And to do this, all I need to do is go allow another app and then go browse. Just move this over. Now, once you have the browse window open, just go to your C drive and you then need to go to program files. We're then looking for the EA folder, open this up and then open up AC. The next thing that you want to do is select this option here, EA anti -cheat .game service. Go ahead and click on open and then go add. Now once you've added that to your Windows firewall and also if you're using a third party security program, go ahead again and try and launch Madden 24 and see if that resolved the issue. If it didn't, then the next thing that you could do is try and temporarily disable your security software in case it is still blocking EA anti-cheat somehow or also Madden 24. If the game then does work, then you know it's something to do with your security that's causing the issue. Now that does pretty much bring me to the end. Also, I want to just add, when you do disable your security um, software, just be very careful as you might not be protected from security threats while it's disabled. So do this obviously at your own risk or blah, 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 whatever. Anyway, that does now bring me to the end of this video. 
I hope one of the methods in the video that I showed you have, has resolved. I'm getting my words totally messed up now. I hope one of the methods in this video has helped resolve the EA anti-cheat error message on your Windows PC. If you did like this video, click the like button below. And if you want to see more computer sluggish videos, then click the subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.